What's up, YouTube? It's Random Tuesday Thoughts. Here we are on Tuesday, on the way home from work. Behind again this week, as per usual. It has been uber busy. I don't know if I've ever had, for whatever reason, May and freaking October are always crazy busy for me. I don't know why. Anyway, I wanted to start off this week with a question. What is your favorite non-yo-yo piece of yo-yo gear? So it can't be a yo-yo, but like, what's your favorite like yo-yo thing that you have? Mine, I had thought a lot about this today. Mine is actually the Yo-Yo Sam hard case. I think that's my favorite thing because I've got like five of them and they're just so good for storage because they stack and they keep everything safe and they're pretty compact for how big they are and they hold a ton of yo-yos. I really, really think that that's the best piece of yo-yo gear. If you're gonna buy like, if you're gonna have a bunch of yo-yos, I think that's the best piece of yo-yo gear. Truthfully, that's probably the thing I don't think about it all that often, but like those are probably the things that I use the most often. And I'll tell you what, I've had one of them I've had for years now, and it's held up beautifully. Like just beautiful. So I think that's my favorite piece. But tell me what's your favorite piece of non yo 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 gear is. Like it's not a yo yo, but it's yo yo gear. Tell me what your favorite one is. Put it down in the comments. Anyway, I wanted to talk about a couple things today. I wanted to ask you guys what you thought about this sort of idea for a video. What I wanted to do is kind of show you guys my kind of yo-yo or everyday carry items. So uh, basically what I carry with me every day that relates to yo-yoing sort of in some way or just you know how I go about my day because I carry a yo-yo with me every day and I carry other yo-yo related items with me every day. And I play yo-yo a lot every day and I use a lot of the items that I have on me for like, you know, you bring a yo-yo, I bring a holster, I've got a backpack, I've got uh, a tool to get the bearing out if I need to, strings, etc. Um, so I wanted to do a video on that and then if that video did well, I wanted to talk about, you know, how to put together your own sort of yo-yo everyday carry package so let me know down in the comments what you guys think about that. Would that be something you'd be interested in or you just want to play yo-yo? Just want to talk about yo-yo? I'm not really talking about it. I'm kind of talking about yo-yo stuff today, just indirectly, I guess. Anyway, other things I wanted to talk about. Another thing I wanted to talk about today was I had seen a comment, two comments actually, but we'll talk about this one first. I had seen a comment about, oh, here's your one dislike, eh, that video usually actually ended up getting like two or three, but somebody was concerned for me that randomly my videos get disliked, this video will probably get one, and they just, you know, mentioned it to me in a like casual like, hey man, what, who doesn't, who dislikes this video, like what's, what's, what's up with them, like, it's okay, I don't honestly know if it's like one guy that just dislikes the video or a couple people that like make sure they click and dislike every video. But they still have to click the video, I still get a view, and I don't really, like if you don't like what I'm talking about, I don't care if you dislike the video. I appreciate that you're watching the video. Honestly, I appreciate that you're clicking on the video to watch it. If you don't like what I'm talking about that day and you tell me you don't like it, that's fine. But if you do like it, I appreciate it if you hit the like button too, because that pushes it out YouTube and like has more people in YouTube world see it and uh, you know maybe gets more people into yo-yo brings more people to my channel which by the way I'm almost at 4k subscribers thanks to you guys of course you guys are awesome so thanks to you guys and shout out to you guys for being awesome and being subscribers and just being around uh, this yo-yo is not a huge community and uh, I'm pretty sure everybody subscribed. That's all of you in top. I don't know if that's everybody, but I uh, really appreciate all of the love and support that you guys give me and have given me over the years because I have fun making these little videos for you guys. I do. It's like my diary or I don't know, but it's I like it. I enjoy it, so thank you. And no, the dislikes do not discourage me. 
I appreciate those people for clicking on the video all the same. But thank you for your concern. If anybody was concerned, you probably weren't. But if anybody was, that's my thoughts on it. The last thing I wanted to talk about today was somebody had brought it up before, and I've talked about this before, but somebody had said something about competition between YouTubers and yo-yo YouTubers, etc., etc. And somebody had sort of, to me, either in a comment, I can't remember where I saw it, it was either in a comment or in a comment on somebody else's video where there was, you know, oh, well, what do you think about this reviewer versus that reviewer, or this guy versus that guy, and I'm like, what are you talking about? There's no, there's no competition. And they brought up a couple of people like, those guys are friends of mine. They like brought up Dylan and Nate and Mike and they were like, I like this guy. Well, I like this guy. And I'm like, I like all those guys. Those guys are my friends. I really, really like them. Um, and there's really not competition between us on YouTube. We actually all talk to each other a good bit. Or at least I talk to all those guys a good bit. And uh, when the Metalhead comes out, you will see them all review it because they're all going to get one. And... We're all friends. There's really no competition on YouTube. Sorry to bust anybody's bubble to, if there was like, anybody thinking like we were gonna have beef and like, us, one of us versus another one or something. It's, that was never gonna happen. It's like, there's no competition. You should be subscribed to everybody's channel. In fact, if you go and look at my like preferred subscribe channels, there's like a list on the main page of the Frozen Brews page. You should go subscribe to all those guys because all those guys are in there. And they're all awesome. They all have awesome YouTube channels. I'll make sure that's updated. I'm not sure that it's current, but it should be. And they should all be in there. But yeah, go and subscribe to all of the Yo-Yo YouTubers because we're all very different, if you can't tell. We're all very different. We have different content. It's different, interesting, and some of it's good. It's all good. I was gonna say some of it's not good. Maybe mine's not good sometimes, but theirs is always good. And. There's no competition between Yo-Yo YouTubers because we're all friends, we all like each other, and uh, we are all very happy for each other's success in whichever way it may come. So, uh, shout out to all of my Yo-Yo YouTuber friends, Dylan, Nate, Mike, mostly them, right? Tokyo Yo-Yo, he's, he's on the other side of the world, sort of, but that's okay, I like him too. And Brandon Vu. Everybody, everybody who does Yo-Yo YouTube, guys are moving, moving the product forward, moving Yo-Yo forward, and that is cool, and that's important, and uh, shout out to everybody for doing that. Gentry does YouTube sometimes. You don't, he doesn't do it that often, but when he does, the video gets, gets some good views, so shout out to Gentry as well. Evan also does good videos sometimes too, and Evan also appears on other people's channels, which I actually really like too about Evan that he appeared, he was on this channel, and then he was on Sam Tabor's channel. Sam Tabor like went to his house, and they did like bottle flipping, but with the World Yo-Yo Championship trophy. That was cool. Or was it the national one? I don't remember, but uh, Sam Tabor's got like a two million subscribers, so that's, uh, that's really fun. But uh, tell me what you guys think down in the comments. Leave me some comments, leave me some suggestions. This is more of a question to you guys video. If you wanna see like, EDC stuff. I actually really like EDC stuff and like EDC channels and things and I like to post like whatever knives I'm carrying or if I'm wearing a watch or my wallet or whatever on Instagram a lot. I actually really, I think it's fun. It's neat to have like little useful trinkets on you every day. I find anyway, I think a yo-yo is a useful trinket. So tell me what you guys think about me putting together like videos of like yo-yo EDC type of stuff because I think that's cool and uh, I could incorporate some other cool stuff into it as well that I'm interested in, like knives and etc. But uh, that's gonna do it for me today, guys. Thanks for watching. Make sure you like and subscribe. Cheers to you. I'll see you next time.